Hi, everybody. Uh, we wanted to start this uh, new Chart Your Future, a little podcast just to provide helpful information that we think you could use uh, as far as your uh, investments going forward. And today, just wanted to highlight two quick pieces. The first piece, as we talk about this bear market that we've been in, we're always looking for that next bull market. And certainly, we don't know when that's going to start. But you can see we've had many bear markets in the past. And this slide goes back to 1946. And if you look at these uh, drawdowns here on the left side of your screen, for instance, 28% in 1946 through 47, 48% 1973 to 74, 51% October of 07 to November of 08. Uh, the average bear market total drawdown has been minus 32.1%. And the average length of time that it took to have that drawdown was just over 11 months. If we look at what the market did one year, three years, and five years beyond those bear market dates, you can see the market was, was very favorable. Uh, the one year uh, return is averaging plus 17.5%, three year average at 37%, and five years later, uh, average is 61%. So the key is to, to hang on. We don't know when that bottom's gonna happen, but we also don't wanna miss any of this bull market uh, that will occur here uh, in the future. The other thing that I'll highlight in regards to the Federal Reserve and the fact that uh, it's hopeful that they are soon done increasing interest rates. This shows some statistics about uh, what the market did 12 months after the Federal Reserve paused their interest rate increases. And you can see uh, going back to 1980 in every instance except one uh, back in 2000, the S&P 500 had a very favorable 12 month period of time uh, with the uh, average being 15.7% increase. So certainly don't wanna miss that uh, as we uh, look to the future. And as always, if you have any questions, feel free to, to reach out. Uh, our phone number is 608-268-5100. Thanks everyone, hope you found this helpful. Bye-bye.